one of my very favorite foodies and podcasters is joining me now, and she's apparently got a lot of feelings on not food, but the soft drink. Host of Your Last Meal, Rachel Bell, is here with me. Okay, we're going to get to this because I okay. have lots of questions, but <laughs> tell me about the podcast right now. Yes, so the show is called Your Last Meal. Right. I've been doing it for about eight years and Eight Hard. years now, yes. I can't believe that. I wow. know. And I interview celebrities about what their last meals would be. And then based on what they say, I bring on other people to talk about the culture, the history, right. and the science, which is why we have a whole bunch of Coca-Cola in front of us. Really? Yes. Yeah, so my latest guest is Moshe Kasher. He's a comedian. Okay. Very. This might be the most funny episode in all of eight years, I honestly. Can't wait. And I have to say, I've been getting messages of people being like, "You guys should get married." The chemistry, and I was like, "Oh, oh now maybe." Wow. I know it's good. So, Your last meal, also a matchmaking. I hope so. Yourself. He's Jewish. My mother will be oh, thrilled. My mother will be. So <laughs> He's also excited. married. My mother won't be thrilled. Okay. Neither will his. All right. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> we're gonna skip him. We're gonna okay. skip him. All yeah. Right. So he has this hierarchy of what he thinks is the best way to drink a Diet Coke is what he likes. Oh, yes, okay. Which is I'm what you like, Team too. Diet Coke. Team Diet Coke. Okay. And so he has an order of what he thinks okay. is best. So we have four out of five of what he was talking okay. about. We have the can, the plastic bottle, the glass bottle, the fountain drink, and then he included the bar gun. So like at a bar, oh, right. you know? Okay. Um, so you tell me first, what do you think your order is going to be? Okay, well, I, I am a I brought all these Cokes for you, but I am a Diet Coke girl. And okay. the, the number one, and by far, is yeah. the McDonald's fountain, fountain. drink. Fountain. Right. Okay. And then I would say the bar gun. Uh-huh. And then this the gla the plastic bottle and the can maybe these two are tied but i will say i almost never drink out of anything that's not a glass so if i go uh -huh. to your house for a party and you hand me this i'm going to say You're could gonna i have it. a glass of yeah. ice yeah so well, that's my order what about you well the reason we're drinking it out of what they come in is because that is kind of part of the experience okay. you know like i think Let's it tastes it. different out of a glass than if you're drinking out of this ice cold can yeah so my well i won't tell you cuz i already did it so oh, okay. but i thought that this was going to be my last because I feel like the plastic bottle makes things warm right. and kind of flat. Um, I also thought that the bar gun was going to be up near the top. And it wasn't. It wasn't. Oh. Not for me. Should we, should we do yeah, it? What do you want to try I'll go first? With you. You, I'm going to okay. follow you. Just for the good sound, let's do this first. Now, okay. This is, when it comes in a bottle, it's Mexican Coke, which right. means that it's made with um, real sugar. Real sugar, okay. Yeah, so it's kind of a little bit you know, it's not exactly the same as the others because it has a little it, bit it of a It is special, taste. right? Ah, okay. It is special. All right. Okay, cheers. I like to smell it first. I do too. Oh, I love smelling everything like a dog. Okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. You cannot do that when someone's about to drink sorry. a carbonated drink. Yeah, it's good. I like a glass bottle. Yeah, I do too. It feels very nostalgic, yeah. not of my youth. And maybe that but it is my youth. It so. is. Yeah, I like the glass bottle. Okay. Okay. We I'm not used to, to sugar here. in my drink, but that is actually delicious. I know it's really good. It's okay. the best time I think because I don't usually drink soda, but at the movies when you have the buttery popcorn, that's when it's and a the good real time sugar for a in Coke. the drink. Okay. Yes. Okay. What's okay. Next? Let's do fountain next. Okay. So are you gonna have your diet? Um, I'll have your the have real your regular for the side by side. Oh, it's really hard for me to drink sugar, but I feel like this has way less flavor than okay, that. Okay, but but I have to go to what is familiar, Nana. right? Wait, Mother's I milk. Think this is diet. No, this is diet. Can I try that? Mm-hmm. We're just this we're just like diet. Here. Yeah. This is definitely Coke. This one is not good. Okay. <laughs> this one they press in for me. That's weird. That All three of them good. taste different to me. Mm -hmm. I don't know what's going on. Okay, give me that one back. Okay. Oh, that's yours. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, let's do the can. So you don't you don't like this one? No, I think that it doesn't have enough syrup. Okay, so for me, this is like coming home. Oh, this is like, I mean, it's weird. Cup. It's weird how much mm -hmm. I love a McDonald's diet Is Coke. it specific okay. to the McDonald's? It is specific okay. to the McDonald's. It has something to do with their straws. It oh. has something to do with the, how they free the cool the Coke. So this I, sound to you is like, I love that. That's just put you right to sleep, ASMR. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what's next? Let's do the can, Okay. which... I don't love a can. I love a can. I do love a can. I think okay. that it feels colder okay. in the can, and then there's that rush down your throat. Yeah, it's 
good. You it like kind it. of burns. <laughs> it does burn. You know? Why is that? Is it because it's stronger? I think it has to do with the vessel. I the, think it must be like the sh maybe that there's more carbonation. Maybe the shape of this opening it just like flows. <laughs> I'm not, not a coke scientist, but apparently I am playing one on TV. <laughs> I mm. love it. I love that we're we're finding the, like a new way to experience it. Yeah, we are. Um, like sommeliers of Coke. Mm -hmm. I like that. You know yeah. what I will say? I like a regular Coke in a can much better than I like a Diet Coke in a can. Isn't it interesting Strange. how it actually Very varies? Weird. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And now last, okay. the bottle. The bottle. Which the bottle. You, this is your least <laughs> favorite. So I thought. So you thought. <laughs> oh. <laughs> the bouquet. Take it in. Okay. Mm -hmm. I, I don't love that. So when I did my like mm -hmm. initial tasting, my order was can number one, bottle number two, which I was so oh, surprised. Okay. I thought they were very similar. Fountain number three, um, okay. the Mexican Coke four, because the bottle that we got was kind of flat. And then fifth was the bar gun. That had okay. very little flavor because I think when they're making cocktails, they're like, nobody wants that much Coke. They want to taste the whiskey and I think it's just not that good. What order okay. are you doing? I'm gonna do, um, I'm gonna do, well, the Diet Coke this way, yes. but then this, the bottle with the real sugar. Uh -huh, I like yeah. that. And then the can, I'm actually really surprised. Yeah. I like that better. And this felt like nothing to me. Yeah, today I'm more like, this. And now I need a little chaser. <laughs> you did. <laughs> what, what else is on the horizon for you? Oh, what's on the More horizon for me? More Yeah, I'm just basically going to drink Coke for my career now. Yeah, that's about it for me. Um, I have an episode coming up next week with Amanda Knox, which is a live episode wow. that we did at the end of last year that's going to be the recording. It was such an amazing interview because people come in with their ideas of right. who Amanda Knox is. Absolutely. It's all very much based on what you read in the tabloids. And I know a lot of people bought tickets to this event. It sold out because they're like, ooh, I want to see wow. Amanda Knox. Yeah. And my hope for the interview was to have people see her as a real person, right. which I could tell everybody did. She is so smart. She is such a good talker. And she just is a human. Yeah. And you know, she humanized herself in this right. interview. But with this experience that most of us will never have, and I can't wait to hear that. Thank you. Thank and you. Thank you for this. <laughs> thank you for this. We're all going to be like, yeah, all within right. 15 minutes. Yeah.